Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel, Miss Little Things, and today uh, we're going to be uh, doing, well I'm going to be doing, a what's on my iPhone 11 video. Um, just wanted to, you know, show you guys what's on my phone and um, I hope you guys uh, will enjoy it. I'm going to go over the apps that I currently, um, you know, loving and my background and things like that. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoy and stay tuned for the demonstration. All right, so here, as you can tell, this is my iPhone 11. Sorry, it's kind of uh, dirty. <laughs> I'm gonna wipe it a little bit. So here it is, you guys. And I'm literally going to have to hover over this because I don't have an iPad stand, so I'm currently recording from my iPad. Anyway, this is my phone. I'll show you guys what I have in it. As you can tell, it's really cute. It's kind of coffee themed. Um, I just love the little pink donuts and the frappuccinos. Well, I say frappuccino, but it doesn't look like it says Starbucks on them, so anyway. I just love the little coffee emojis. Um, I'm gonna, and here is my home screen. Um, so I'm just gonna put it down a little bit. Just kind of hold, hover over it. I'm gonna have to put that on there. But anyway, here it is. So on my home screen, which is this one, I just basically just have the camera, the clock, the settings, and my uh, Safari. Here at the bottom, we have phone, um, FaceTime messaging and my notes that I always have for everything. Um, you guys already know what that looks like. I pretty much just have like my to-do list for every day, ASMR videos, all that stuff, like my gratitude. I try to keep a list of what I'm grateful for, you guys. It does help out during these times. Um, also, as you can tell, my background is the same thing, the same theme. Um, it looks like it's Frappuccinos from Starbucks and Macchiatos. I just love how cute that looks, you guys. Um, I got these backgrounds from Pinterest. I'll show you guys in a second where I got them from. This is my social media um, folder. So anyway, I go here on Pinterest. This is my pin board. If you guys want to search for me, my name is under Ale Cleveland. So anyway, I have all different types of pins, but this is the one I use the most. And I just collect different types of wallpapers, you guys. So what I do is I normally just save them to my pin board. And here, like, you see all different kinds of uh, wallpapers that I've collected to just kind of go with my mood. I love to just change my background for fun. Um, you know, whenever you're bored or whatever. I love this one, Reach for the Sky. I've had this one, Breathe. I'm sure everybody knows about this, or maybe um, for those that don't know. But anyway, this is where I get my wall screen paper, um, wall screen background paper, however you say it. And what I do is just select the ones that I want, and then I just click on the three little dots right here, the menu. And then just put download image and it directly downloads it to your gallery and then from your gallery you are able to change it so um, I'll just quickly demonstrate to you guys I'm like looking for my gallery real quick okay so here's all my stuff um, I selected this one so I just go ahead and do this and uh, select use as wallpaper so it should pop up I'm just gonna go back home anyway and this is my screen for my apps um, as you can tell I have different types of folders I have to be that person I know some people like the whole um, like I don't even know how to call it I'm gonna say the chaotic version of this uh, which is just apps like this and I cannot stand that so I obviously had to organize my stuff. Um, the current app that I love, that I've been working on lately, is Jor. Um, obviously, it has all um, my personal stuff. 
but I'm not going to show you guys that because obviously that's for me. <laughs> and um, it's pretty much it, pretty much a journal, uh, online journal, to see how you're feeling. Um, you know, for your mental health, for your emotional health, for your spiritual health, whatever it is that you need to jot down is just going to always remind you um, to you know do a journal entry so I really love that you guys it really helps out to check on yourself um, on how you're feeling especially nowadays um, you know I'll have days where I don't even know how I'm feeling but um, because it asks you a couple of questions um, to kind of refocus yourself on what it is that's important to you so that I really like about this app um, I already journal today I guess uh, so I guess I have to do one tomorrow there's one for your dreams finding the bright side how to journal sleep with a clear mind like any exercises that you guys would like to try this app has it for like mental exercises or just uh, you know trying to challenge your mind to stay positive I really love that but if you want more they uh, have a premium version of this app uh, but I guess it's like 59 bucks a year it's it's worth it to me I don't have it right now but you know late later on I'm actually planning to get it but for now the basic version is just this one and I really love this app it's been helping me a lot um, I really like it so that's the app that I'm working with the most today um, I have this to-do list but I, I don't really use it I just have like random stuff that I need to buy <laughs> yes uh, people need to buy underwear um, okay so I'm gonna start from the top I have miscellaneous so you got your iMovie iTunes store uh, find my birthdays keynote shortcut swift key and then I have banks you guys already know Chase Bank of America Wells Fargo business um, I have these apps of job search Indeed, offer up Robinhood, which is like a stock app that I really like. T-Mobile, PayPal, Credit Karma. I have Amazon for shopping, eBay, Dosh, Yelp, AliExpress. Uh, this one, Shop, it used to have like a little A on it. I'm not sure what the name was before. I might have forgotten, but I really like this app because it, it keeps... Um, Focus on your recent items that you just uh, bought online so it'll tell you when it's coming I really love wish as well um, you can find really cheap affordable stuff in there I, like it's incredible how cheap this is but I really like it it takes a while for it to upload I don't know why but um, they give you different types of like coupons for the day something like that uh, then you can just shop for literally anything you want and it's super cheap. You can find like eyelashes, like lashes here for like five bucks. I don't even know. And then you got AliExpress, which is sort of like that one. I have not formed an account here yet and I have not tried to purchase anything from here yet. So I'll check it out. Um, you guys already know Amazon, eBay. Dosh is kind of like an app that's linked to your cards. So whenever you can find like, you know, stores, I have this feature they'll give you points or cash back I have 12 bucks that's not enough to transfer yet so yeah if you guys don't have that app I highly recommend it um, for utilities you guys have you know you guys already know this is like the basic stuff I rarely use these um, except calculator they got voice memos compass measure um, tips watch Apple store garage band numbers pages iTunes you I don't even know what that is contacts um, my Toyota and then Google Drive and this is for food um, and obviously rides you guys have uh, I'm sure many people have Starbucks Lyft Grubhub DoorDash Krispy Kreme Uber Postmates Robix and Uber Eats um, I use the CSC Pay Mo Mobile to do my laundry here at home for the machine. So, okay, and then for fun, I have Hulu, Netflix, Disney, TikTok, Mario, Mario Kart, Call of Duty. I highly recommend Mario Run, you guys. It's really fun, my favorite. And then Call of Duty. Um, I 
was hooked on TikTok for like a whole week and I don't know what happened. I just lost interest, but I still have it because there's still some funny things in there. I love going through TikTok. <laughs> so yeah, and I have Disney Plus app, of course, because who wouldn't want that? <laughs> um, but yeah, this is my fun app uh, drawer or folder, whatever. Um, this is for my camera. I have Canon print to print for my printer that has no ink at the moment. I have InShot, Clips, Wands View for my camera to check on my pets when I'm not home. This is my photo gallery and PixArt college photos unfold. I haven't tried unfold, so I will try that one. I just downloaded it, but I haven't gone to it yet. All right, next um, folder, it's for music. I have Shazam, Spotify, Pandora, Apple Music, Share It, Play Music. This app right here is great if you have um, an old phone uh, or an Android phone that you can download for music with and then you can just transfer it on here. Just an FYI, you guys. I really hate that you can't download free music on iPhone. That is like literally the only complaint that I have about this phone so far. Um, Play Music is for Google Play. So if you had any um, songs downloaded from your previous uh, devices, it'll just save all of them to here. Uh, then I have Maps or weather apps. Um, I have files in here just because I don't really go in there. Um, I don't know what home is. I have reminders. Um, I have the app store, maps, Chrome, live wallpapers, wallet, Google, Google calendar, weather, and Google maps. So in case one fails and I got like three other more <laughs> to back me up in case I'm lost, you guys. And then here I have my social media folder. I have YouTube, Instagram, Snapchat, um, YouTube Studio, Pinterest, Gmail, Messenger, Twitter, Facebook, Mail, and Canvas Stories, which I have not used yet. But I'd like to give it a shot. If you guys have any, um, you know, cool tips and tricks, let me know. Also, um, if you guys look me up on Instagram, I'm under MS Little Things uh, with double S at the end. I will share all my social media with you guys. Um, Facebook I have only for family, Messenger for family, um, Snapchat most of the time. I'm just on there because I keep in touch with family. I don't really use it a lot. Um, it's not as fun as it used to be, that's for sure. Then Instagram, I'm on there just to like, I love just collecting things like that I see on Instagram because there's so many pretty ideas uh, to work with whether they're quotes or um, you know ideas to kind of organize your home or decorate I love Instagram and I love Pinterest YouTube however is my main bitch <laughs> you guys already know I I don't know about anyone else but I just can't live without YouTube um, these are all things that I don't even watch like half of these. They're just like, oh, um, so you watch this one time. I'm just going to request like a million videos of the same thing that you just watched that one time. So I don't know. Um, I watch a lot of tech videos, as you can tell, and a lot of dog videos because those are the best. And I don't know about vlogging. Like I gave, I gave vlog videos a chance, but anyway, um, yeah, I'm on YouTube half the time if you guys look for my ASMR channel um, I'll show you guys oh sorry Oops. okay I'm just gonna quickly show you guys my channel so this is my ASMR channel if you guys want to check it out um, you know I try to upload maybe once or twice a week a week uh, if you guys are interested in hearing my stuff to fall asleep Anyway, I'll link everything down below, including my social media. And then my other channel is Miss Little Things. This one. So, if you guys want to also check out my other channel, let me know. I just barely started uploading on this one. And uh, there's more, but I don't know why it doesn't bring the rest. Okay, here it is. So yeah, this one's new, you guys check it out.
and I'll have this video uploaded on here as well. And yeah, that's YouTube for you guys. Um, in the next folder, I have obviously for my medication, <laughs> um, I have Leafly and Weed Maps to help me get the best deals. And then just my calendar. Next folder is pretty much just useless apps. Um, books I'm barely learning to use because I didn't know that I mean well I'm getting kind of familiarized with just reading things online it's actually way funner than I thought um, to be honest I have a couple of books here uh, currently I'm reading metahuman from Deepak Chopra is that how you pronounce his name I I don't want to say his name wrong I know I am familiar with him Deepak Chopra I hope I'm saying it correct but I've been on that book made a human recently it's really awesome I highly recommend it there's news podcast TV test flight weather feedback and then health I don't really use the rest of these um, I don't I'm not really much of a podcast person if I do listen to any podcasts I go on Spotify but anyway I hope you guys enjoyed this video also um, if you guys have any suggestions on how to organize this in a cuter way, let me know. I am up for it. Anyway, that's um, everything that's on my phone. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoy and stay safe out there, guys. All right, see you guys next time.